let's talk about wind punch, Feng Shui. It's called wind punch because it's really fast punch. Really, really fast punch. It's not so powerful punch, but it's the Bruce Lee famous punch, you know, when he starts like this and do this movement, wind punch. No, this punch is very, very fast because we intend, we put our mind to the returning movement. This is the outgoing movement and we strike with this part of the hand with the elbow pretty leveled, pretty parallel to the ground. So the movement is this one. We can strike with open palm just as fingers for example to the eyes. Kfir. This is Kfir and he will help me today. So I just like imagine these are Kfir's eyes. Quick. Light and quick. If I want to make this strike heavy, I will hit not with perpendicular punch or open palm, but with parallel, with horizontal strike. Why this is heavier, I will explain later, but it will be heavier. Fast and heavy. You see, this is just one way of to drill it. I stand with my feet parallel and just half step in. If I'm forgetting thinking about the return, it will be it will look like this. I forgot to return the hand, but if I want to be fast, I must return the hand. Heavy, fast. Heavy, fast. Why is the difference between the heavy and the fast? Well, this mus muscle works when we are in supination. When we are in pronation, the tendon is twisted and this muscle is not operating. So we want to make fast movement. We work with more muscles to stop the movement. Otherwise, we will injure ourselves. We have accelerometers in our tissues in the elbow and they know when we go too fast for the arm. The brain sends signals to stop the movement. So if we intend on the returning, we already have this preparation and we can go faster. So if you want to be fast, we need to intend on the returning. If you want to be heavy, you need less uh, less muscles to return your hand and then you'll be slower but heavier. So horizontal when you're actually in pronation. When you're in supination you can be faster. Few ways to drill this punch and the first one is pretty simple. We just stand. We can do it in low mabu or in high stance. It doesn't really matter. Hands here and we just move into low ma or half step. It doesn't really matter, it's just making some movement sideways. Hands up here and we strike. Pretty simple, straight forward strike. Fast and light, fast and light, heavy, as fast as you can, heavy, as fast as you can, light. Okay? Now, if I do it in low might, look like this. You see? Through the rare low ma step. Another way to drill it up is using dumbbells, of course, to uh, construct the heaviness sensation. Again, we can do it also static or with a side step, doesn't matter, just this movement. See? I draw circle, a bit circular movement, forward and backward, up and down. This is for the heavy, for the pronation movement. Here I have one kilo of dumbbells, but you can do it with heavier. Guess up to five is okay, because we still want to um, 
be light enough. So this is to construct the sensation of the heaviness, the weight. Now pay attention that my elbow doesn't go up like this, it stays parallel to the floor and lower. This is one way and the other way is of course with the hands perpendicular to the floor like this. It's hard to do the round movement this way, it's easier in pronation, but in supination we can do it with one hand. And pay attention to the returning. The returning is more important. Without the returning, the hand stays here and it's slow and it's supposed to be light and fast punch. Light, heavy. Some applications for the wind punch, we want to bypass. So this is one. Pay attention that this movement is actually the returning movement. I pull Kfir's hand, I make him some whiplash, and you see I switch hands and in, and it can be heavier. See? I just want to move. This is a bypassing movement. So this is a basic movement and we can develop it further. Okay? If he comes to me, okay, very fast. If I want to close the distance, okay, so I, and I know he's going to strike me, strike, I just divert him and strike, fast. This is the Bruce Lee punch. 